Uh, would you more uh, would you mind defining train signaling and train collision that everyone keeps asking for? Uh, okay, well, so train collision would mean you know if trains colliding with each other, right? So something would happen if your trains collide. Um, so right now, if trains don't collide. You can have like a thousand trains on one rail if you want, and they're all like clipping into each other and doing whatever. Uh, but we would be adding train collision so that that's not really possible. Um, and in order to mitigate that, we would then add train signaling. And what train signaling would be doing would be like leaving signals on the train tracks in order so that, uh, you know, to stop trains and, uh, and let other trains through kind of thing. So basically how traffic lights work at, a, at an intersection uh they let one flow of uh, traffic come through once that's done they'll let other traffic go through and that's kind of what the signal will be going for so that would mean if we added that there would have to be a lot more kind of like thinking and planning with your, your trains um yeah so they might be a little bit more difficult to set up you know if you have more complicated setups and then you would have to learn how to use signaling etc to make sure that it works that it all works so that your trains don't collide. But as for so people saying like, does it mean it won't trade uh, collide with environment, rails, walls, foundations? I, I don't, I don't know currently what the plan is in terms of train collision with environment and stuff like that. I don't actually know. Uh, but when, when all I know is that when we've talked about train collision, we mean train on train collision. 